Alright guys, it's time to whip out my beastly aquatic tame. Come on, you ready to fight me? Bitch! Oh yeah, what are you gonna do, mate? What are you gonna do? Over here, Hello, mate. we're back for a new video. We're back on the arc and we're back on the Let's Play series! So today, I did want to venture into the ocean again and actually try and tame something. I'm gonna try and tame a Basilosaurus. And I'm gonna do it the most unorthodox way ever. And probably the stupidest way ever, but I don't even care. So I haven't got that many creatures. They're probably good at all in the ocean, so I'm gonna take one that is probably the strangest thing ever to take in to the ocean. First thing before we leave to go to the ocean, I'm going to show you guys my base because I haven't actually shown off my base yet. And uh yeah. We have been uh busy, I guess. As you can see we've got a nice crat in area here, we got the ankler with a cheeky little Circus hat on, he's looking damn cool. Found all these tech storage in the loot crates that you find on the land because they're OP. To be honest, found a lot of um, stuff from these loot crates on the land because you know they're just crazy. You find the destruction and everything. And I haven't really made much of this stuff anyway. I've just I've obviously made a few forges because we got loads for burning charcoal for some ammo and stuff like that. But yeah, we got fabricators, we got our chemistry sets. Got a cheeky grill, two gachas because I tamed a 145 off camera. Beautiful 145 female. Took me ages to find that one as well, but you know, it's got to be done on this map because you can find the gachas that easily. Two grinders, loads of vaults for storage and just putting random stuff in here really. And uh, yeah, found these grinders in the loot crate as well. Got a tech transmitter, found that in a loot crate, but you know, can't use it. I haven't learned the engram, so can't even turn it on lock. Cool. Then we go into the base. This is our main base. We got some some of the new new structures in the game. Looking damn good. I must say I don't really use the egg incubator at all. I haven't used it at all actually, because all we've been doing is breeding chalamates and I've started breeding mammoths again. As you may have remember, I'm I was breeding them on extinction and got quite a bit uh into that but uh, anyway I will be carrying on with that we got all our vaults for all storage storage in here we got all our weapons ammo and stuff like that we got some fabricators chemistry sets fridges for days industrial cookie here for all the foods and all that stuff that we like to eat and we got all the cryo fridges for some of our tames which we don't really still have that many tames but this is what I like we got the stairs going up uh, we haven't done anything with the bit above the stairs yet, but we do plan on doing some without at some point. Uh, this is mine and the girlfriend's bedroom, and she's asleep on the bed. Look at her go. So we got our little carpet in here. Look at that beautiful carpet. Who knew you could have a carpet on the ark? It's actually just a load of rugs, but it looks cool when you put them on on top of each other. And yeah, there's just my uh, storage and stuff like that for my own stuff. And the girlfriend stuff. And if you go into here, this is. I'm pretty jazzed with this bedroom because this is Harry's room and he's not a beast. He's actually an amateur, but uh, he just misspelt it on there. I'm guessing, but. Oh, there he is! Look at him! Boom! Boom! Love that. Oh, he's got a baby giga. Hello! Yeah, he's got a pretty cool room. He's painted it and everything. And he's got all his cool, cool mates. He's got his uh, little statues of mates because, you know, he doesn't really have any mates in real life. So, yeah, he's got to have the, the statues in there, really. And he's got some war drums. <laughs> and if we go outside, I figured I'd show you guys the whole base because at least I'm not hiding anything off camera now because these are the things we've been taming off camera. Harry's tamed these two for Lonosaurs and these two... Uteranus. I haven't tamed them, but they're pretty cool colours actually. I like that colour, it's really nice. Got some beehives as well, captured those. I didn't do that either. And here's Harry's cheeky little greenhouse with a dumb bait all right on top. Oh, he's trying to escape. That's not allowed. Come on, be outside. And there's my mammoth party. And that is our base as of yet. We're going to fly to the toilet of dreams and hoping I've got everything I need. If I don't, then that's too bad. I have heard that a Basilosaurus will spawn uh, commonly in this uh, area here, in the little water trench in the middle of the uh, right side of the map. So we're going to go straight down and hope we can find one. Of course it's dark as well, by the way. Dive it straight in. See what we can see. Absolutely. 
absolutely nothing. Lots of sharks. Oh my god. <gasps> we found one. Oh, this is a high level. What? We found lots of shit. Hey, that's not good. Oh my god. What is this? Why is there so many sharks, man? What level's this guy anyway? Oh shit! What the hell was that? I hit well hard. Come on, boom! Oh, I can't even see him, but I hit him. Oh, there you are. Boom! Not that. Oh, I don't know what to do about this. Paranoid AF. I'll tell you that. What level are you? Oh, it's only a level 25. That's annoying. Well, let's see if we can find some more. I'm not interested in this area. It's scary as hell. See you guys later. Oh my god, there's just alpha sharks. What? Everywhere! Oh, we found another one. Level 90. I might take that, actually. Alright, guys. It's time to whip out my beastly aquatic team. Go ahead, you ready to fight me? Bitch! Oh shit! That's not. Did not get a plan. Oh yeah, what are you gonna do, mate? What are you gonna do? Are you son? Oh, you got mates as well, yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, there's three of them. Oh yes. Yeah. See you later. You can't touch me, look. You guys have messed with the wrong mummy. Oh, I'm hungry. I stamp him in the water. No. Oh, oh I just hit that stupid fish school. They can proper mess up my character. I need to kill these things. Oh god, there's loads on me. Don't worry, we came here for this. We're battering these manners. Look at them. Have that. Yeah, have that. Can't touch us at all, look! I'm a boost! You don't know who they're messing with, do they? Really? Basilosaurus, where have you gone? Oh, there he is, he's down there. I'm gonna go for a cheeky feed, watch this. Yeah, have that. I'm gonna go and get my mammy out of the wati. I've got my cheeky snow owl with me as well. Just so we can heal these guys up. Like, just in case, you know, may as well heal him. Might have to fight some more mantas off again. Because this guy is it's one of my mutated mammoths. So hopefully when I've finished mutating my mouse, they're gonna be absolute monsters. I think I'm on about 15k on the health mutations and about and they hatch about 650 melee with on the melee mutations, so yeah, he's gonna be pretty strong, pretty strong. I'm gonna try him out on some uh, missions and boss fights and stuff, I think. Basilosaurus, where you are? Oh, I just heard him. <laughs> Hello. Do you want to get fed? No, of course you don't. So, obviously after the first feed, it takes a year or two for him to eat again. So I might be waiting a while, but this is a... Uh... Well, I'm just gonna tame a little night. I'll probably get high level next, but... I think I want to build like a water base, probably in this trench somewhere. There's a really good spot that I like by the waterfall, and it's quite low, so you can probably build like a water pen and stuff there. So I think I'm probably going to do that at some point. Ideally, I want some decent basilosaurus to go in the ocean biome area slash underground water or whatever you want to call it kind of area. So I can kill some alpha twos and stuff, and maybe get some fishing rods and get some fish in for some high tier blueprints. If that actually works on Gen 2. Because my mate said he found a Mastercraft fishing rod and still got crap all blueprints. As you guys may have noticed, the primitive ones suck. If you watch our last episode, we got absolutely nothing. Do you want to eat yet? No! Damn it! I could feed him! Oh, nice bit of cheeky lag there. Make sure nothing wants to eat me. 
Oh, now we're off, guys. Now we're off. See ya. Hey, where you going? I need to feed you. No. I'm pretty paranoid, not gonna lie. Got my mammoth at the ready if I need backup. Trying to run from here, yeah. Let me feed you again, please. There we go, nice. One more. One more to go. I wonder if there's any more around here. Need to buy a cryopod though first. Can I use HLNA in the what here? That's the question. Should be able to, surely. Yes. Oh yeah, I can. Yep, I want to buy a cryopod. Thank you very much. Oh, I can. What? Oh yeah, I can. Cheers, survivor. Where you gone? Where'd you go, man? Oh. Somehow I've lost him. Oh, there he is. Drive by. Boom! I'm a beast. 13,400 hours for a level 90. Where did the crybot go I just bought? Did it not go into my inventory when I bought it? Because I'm underwater. Alright, I guess I'm buying it again? Got some hexagons you're keen to spend? I don't think it took money off my... I don't Jeez, think it took money off my account, to be honest, anyway. Alright, we're going in. Let's crypod this boy up. Ah, oh, Quetzal! What level's that? Oh! No, I can't say no to a 140 Quetz. I'm taming this, by the way, I have to. It has to be done. Why are you flying up there? Oh, my boost! Oh, right in the bun! How are these shots missing? What is this treachery? He's going up to the sky. What is he doing, look? He's looking up there as well, he wants it. Bitch! Right in the nostril, that was. I just hit him, but it didn't hit him. Alrighty then, love taming a quest. Does this to me every time. Missed, apparently. Watch this miss then. Boom! Okay, it's still missed. What? That's literally what I just did to you, but it missed. Oh, I just hit him and it didn't hit him! If he falls in the water after all this, I'm not going to be happy. peek a -boo. Bish! Missed. Oh, he comes for the nostril. Shake! Eight! I hit... Why? Why is it doing this to me? Ooh, I'm hitting you everywhere in the body! And, oh, there we go. So that one worked. Okay. What? Does everyone else get this when they tame a quest? Because I get it all the time. It pisses me off. Clearly, I'm shooting them. And it doesn't work half the time. We would like the one footy quetzal right in the end. Beesh. Let's try some god tier crossbow shots. Crossbow shot of the week. Huh! Ah! Oh. Ah! Oh. Boom in the head. Huh! Long shot. Ah! Oh. Hopefully this is an opposite sex to my other one. I can't remember what sex my other one is. Boosh! Okay then. Oh, double shot there. Huh! Oh, what a shot. I'm an absolute beast. He's coming back for a scan. He wants my scan. 10k torpor out of 17,500. Or well, 900, is it? I don't even know. 200. Got everything wrong. Coming for a drop on his head. Boom! Oh, that's that. Let's check his torpor. It's got to be close. 14k. 
Oh, we got two shots in a row there. I don't know if he's flying though. That is hostile territory. 15k. Let's check his top ball. Hopefully for the third and final time. Oh, he's close. Maybe one more shot. It might be out. I haven't got any spite walls either. I did not think this through. Let's see then. Move to truth. Boom! Are you getting knocked? Are you getting knocked? Don't you dare go in the water. Mm, looks like we need one more. And there he goes. And it looks like he might be going in the water. Oh my god. Could not be any more perfect. Look at that. Alright, we need hide. Have I got hide? Please tell me I got hide. I've got no hide whatsoever, no. That'll be, pig, that'll be. Right, let's see. What's the stats like? I don't really know what's good stats for a quest or not. To be honest, that looks just like any quest stats you'd ever see in the wild, to be honest. Oh, piranha. Hello. Bang! Alright, we're just going to uh, wait around for a little bit, wait for his uh, food to go down a bit. I'll put some narcotics in him as well when that goes down, and I'll get hunting some prime meat, and we'll hopefully entertain the team in. And hopefully it's the opposite sex to the metal farmer we have. Because that would be sweet, I feel like it's, but they're both males, but hopefully not. Alright, so it's been about 15 minutes before we knock this guy out. Probably a bit longer now, 20 I'd say. I've put some narcotics in him, and... I need to find some prime meat, really. Did see a spider down here earlier? That'd be easy to kill with my shotgun, so let's see if he's still here. Oh, he's a tank. Doesn't want to die, does he? Oh, oh my god. What the hell's going on there? Oh, it's the, oh, it's the little spade. Oh my god. He's not living through that, I'll tell you that. Save him! Oh, can I save him? No, of course not. You little bastards. That was unfair. There was like eight of them picking on one guy. Right, Spino, where you at? Wait, did someone eat my Spino? They did as well. Who the hell ate my Spino? I got bam, bear prime meat on this. Sarkos for days. Right, we're out of there, let's go. Let's go and team this guy up. Let's give him some raw prime meat goodness. Let's see if he insta teams then. Oh, no, he's not gonna. Should have left him sleep a bit longer. Do you reckon I'm gonna have to get some more, aren't I? Oh. Should have used a pickaxe on those Sarkos. I thought I'd get enough from them. No! Boom! This guy's invincible, man. See you later. Sorry, mate. Okay. Sorry, mate. Boom! Well, he took that one, didn't he? Well, that should be enough, hopefully. Alright, at least he's definitely got enough prime meat in him now. Get me out of this wing! Bought myself a crowbot already. I'm ready to crowbot him right up. 88% tamed. Won't be long until he's tamed up. And we're going to find out if we have a mating pair or not. Alrighty, we made it back to base. We tamed our Quetzal. He's in the cryopod. And of course, my other Quetzal was a male, so I'm going to have to tame another high level just if I wanted to make them for the imprint and stuff, but uh, that's fine. Anyway, this is something I did forget to show you guys before when I did a little base tour, but we got all our mutated shadow mains over here, and obviously my mates tamed an Astrid Delphis. But yeah, we got some cool colours, and they've got amazing stats, so... I do plan in the next episode to hopefully start doing some missions. I have got I want to do the Gamma boss and then do the beta after that, so I need to do all the Gamma missions. We finally got a water tame. 
Not a mammoth, by the way. Just throw up my deep sea diver in the old base. Good job, mate. Thanks for the uh, Basilosaurus. Also, I do want to build a water base, so I'm going to probably farm loads of stuff over the next few days and get myself a water base built. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please feel free to check out the channel if you did. And I'll catch you guys in the next video in the series. Take care. Hey, Goodbye. You.